Hey everyone, <clears throat> excuse me, it's Katrina Sawa here, the Jumpstart Your Biz Coach with jumpstartyourbiznow.com. And I wanted to come on and kind of give you a little nudge, a reminder to let's thank yourself first this year. Let's, this holiday, instead of worrying about everybody else first, we need to worry about you first. You first, then your family, and then everybody else. So I want you to repeat that back to me. If you're watching this, I say, me first, then my family, then my clients, then everybody else. Do it again. Me first, then my family, then my clients, then everybody else. And that's the way it should be because if you are Filling, if you're not filling your own cup to where it's overflowing with energy and abundance and positivity, uh, then you're going to be serving from an empty cup or a half filled cup. You need to serve from your saucer and not from your cup. So the overflow is what you give to others and the cup is what you need to fill your tanks first. I talk about in one of my events in my book about your love tanks. <clears throat> and <clears throat> excuse me this is what's um, important about your love tanks is it's the stuff that fuels your passion it's the stuff that fuels the love side of your life the personal side the relationships the family um, your self-care your um, your own kindness to yourself it's whatever fuels that for me it's being around loved ones, people that support me, nurture me, love me, give me attention and affection. It's my husband and my stepdaughter and my dog even and other friends and family members that are positive all the time and not the negative ones. Those are the people that fuel my passion, fuel my energy, fuel my motivation to do the things I want to do and also allow myself to and give myself the permission to take a day off to unwind, to leave early, to, you know, make sure I do the stuff I need to do in the morning before I serve everybody else, before I check my email, before I worry about what fires are in my inbox, right? I just want to remind you this Thanksgiving, especially for those of us who are in the U.S., happy Thanksgiving uh, week, is uh, be thankful for yourself. Be thankful for yourself first. Okay, and give gratitude and thanks to yourself first because you deserve it. Stop worrying about everybody else first because life is too short and some people you might be giving to don't appreciate you. And if that's the case, then I would try to maybe um, stay clear of those people as much as possible. I'm really careful now who I spend my time with, who I surround myself with, whether they're clients of mine or friends or joint venture partners, just people out there in general, groups that I go to for Zoom calls and networking. Um, I'm really, really careful of who I'm surrounding myself because I always say you gotta stay in the conversation and you gotta stay in the conversation but with the right people, the people that love on you, believe in you, and motivate you to be your very best and to put yourself first. So this Thanksgiving and this holiday season from now through the end of the year and hopefully beyond, I really want you to think about putting yourself first. It makes a huge difference and it doesn't mean that you're not gonna get clients. It doesn't mean that you're not gonna be out there in marketing. It doesn't mean that you're not gonna get in front of enough people. It just means you're gonna get out there with the right energy. And you're gonna be the person you need to be to attract 100% of the perfect people into your business. And you just have to trust. You have to trust that that's gonna work and it's all gonna work itself out and enough people have come and you're gonna have an abundance amount of success uh, with your business, your life, your relationships, your health, and, um, and now's the time. Now's the time to love on yourself more, okay? And stop. Stop settling for negative people. Stop um, settling for less. Stop taking on those crappy clients. Stop just being a doormat. Stop being the things that you know you don't need to do just because you think you need to do it. And restructure your entire life. You can do this. 
restructure and redesign your business around the kind of life you want to live rather than fitting your life in around your business and you deserve it. So happy Thanksgiving, happy holidays, and uh, connect with me if you want a positive uh, mindset uh, conversation around growing your business. I would love to have that with you uh, after Thanksgiving and, uh, and beyond. Okay, bye everyone. Have a great day.